Well, Eddie, how's the job hunting going? I know yourself. No, I don't. You see, I've got a job, Eddie. <laughs> Well, as scrap going back to the channel, hope you're all doing well. Welcome back to Irish Rewind. Today we're doing Hardy Books. I've never seen Hardy Books before in my life. If you've already seen it, hopefully it's like a throwback for you. And if you've not seen it before, we're gonna watch a funny Irish TV show. So if you're new to the channel, Irish Rewind is basically we go back and watch Irish TV shows or Irish videos, just basically stuff that's Irish that's been forgotten about. We've done Mrs. Brown's Boys, Young Offenders, a load of them. I'll leave a link to the place in the description. Yeah, let's get straight into it. Sorry, dick lips. Nice car. This just looks like a vlog, man. It just looks like some Irish fella doing a fucking vlog. I'm a man of the world. I've travelled far and wide. <laughs> My knowledge is limitless. And what countries have you visited? I've visited all of them. Not in the actual physical sense, more in the the mind. Like me, my fucking geogaster stuff. Yeah, is that the girl with the tattoo above her arse? <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, give her one for me, okay? Give her one for me! Oh, we've all been there. If your father's not said that to you before in your life, you've not lived in Ireland. All right, Dad. Take care, mate. Good luck. <laughs> I've known Eddie since God was a boy. We were in the same maths class together. <laughs> He's got a good old heart. You he know? <laughs> is that your... Oh, is that PJ Gallagher? Well, I was online there recently and I typed in www.hangupsidedown.com www. <laughs> Crouching tiger, hidden lagging. This is like the Irish in-betweeners. If you could describe yourself in four words, what would they be? Well, I don't know. After this interview, uh, probably unemployed. On the door. I told him he ran over by a load of cattle in your intensive care. Did he believe you? He seemed to go for a chat, yeah. <laughs> ran over by a load of cattle, eh? <laughs> That's fair funny. That must have happened to someone. That's the locals. Nice little chaps. This is the food. <laughs> nice little chaps. Just the Zimbabweans, you know? Any word from that girl, uh, Noreen? No. You didn't cheat on her by any chance, did you? <laughs> well, <laughs> I cheated on her with a woman called Having the Crack. What's the game? The game? Yeah. The crack in Iraq, like. Sorry? How many can you? What's the, what's the, what's the crack in Iraq? <laughs> that's class. We should get the fuck out of here while you can. Sure, that's what the plan is, Mick, you know? If we win King of the Town, sure, we can go over to beat the like. We'll be getting rim jobs all over the place. <laughs> Jesus, he's like a suck girl. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> This is such like um culture humor. I need to watch all of this show. This is fucking amazing. Three hours, you know, training every night and then the rest of the time <laughs> the training sessions that just go on forever and you never fuck sleep. off. Times like this I'd wish to listen to what the owl are talking about. Oh you evicted? She looking well. Thanks. What's for you, love? The one in the middle, cute as fuck. This is basically Love Island. Two mates. Danger. <laughs> Danger. Danger. Man, this is basically like, this is basically where like every 22 year old's humour has come from. Danger, lad. I just want to come around with the house and give you the pump on you deserve and, No, bend you over and do stuff. <laughs> says you bend you over and do stuff. <laughs> Guess what happened to me last night? I have fair idea what happened to you. Got the ride off an old milf. Yeah. 45. Body work was immaculate. Not a sound out of her, no rust. Just in perfect condition, like, you know? No 45, rust! Man. Yeah, yeah. No, you do, I know all the lines, man. All right. the lines there is to know. I've been lying awake night after night thinking about the lines, hey. What's this? Mr. Right. O'Donnell, if you'd like to go back to the test centre, please, now. No. I think we're finished. No bother, am I finished already? Am I that good? No, Mr. O'Donnell. Oh, you're good. terrible. You failed. What the fuck are you talking about, man? We're out on the road five minutes. I've done everything you wanted me to do. Where do it generally just feels like someone's just made a YouTube video of their life. Why start? Gross negligence at the median strip. Use of a mobile phone. What about it? And numerous what about it? stops. One of which was to get an ice cream. Yeah, you loved that ice cream, didn't you? Mr. <laughs> look back to the test centre, please. Back to the test centre. So I'm not good enough to pass your test, but you want me to drop you back to the test centre? Now get out to fuck. <laughs> this is the Don't give it. Damn, where is it? Get out of the clown. Get out. <laughs> I didn't pass your test, you want to try pass your test center, lad? When I'm doing these reaction videos, I do sometimes like over exaggerate if something's funny or not, like. I feel like I was doing that in the Fat Earth Head one, but this is genuinely fucking amazing. Oh my god. It's the real me, hey. Francis, your cheese on the table! Uh, mum, I'm just doing something, mum. <laughs> Did you hear me, Francis? Look, our lady. <laughs> Fuck off. Francis, don't you talk to me like that in this house. And stop with this stupid voice. Oh. Lad, that's literally JMY. If you know JMY from TikTok, it literally, it, it's the exact same way he talks. 
This is where he got it from. Your ideal woman is 5'10", brunette, Virgo, with a mole on the inside of her leg. Give it a pin there, will you? I'll write this down. <laughs> well, Eddie, how's the job hunting going? I know yourself. No, I don't. You see, I've got a job, Eddie. <laughs> Oh, whoever wrote these, man, are, is just fucking lit. Oh, man. Every time, we come in here, it's the same thing with you. There's more chance of Stephen Hawkins getting trials of Inter Milan than there is me finding work. Well, yeah, there's two types of women in Cash Town. <laughs> there's the finers, I call. They're the ones now that read books. Then you have the other ones. You can walk up to them and you can just dog into them. I would love to see... I'm actually sweating. Some business. It's not the heat wave. <laughs> Should I go, boys? <sighs> Apparently they're tough as fuck. But, uh... You dance with the snake in the snake bed, you're gonna get slithered on. And I've got a lot of fucking slime to dish out to boys, I can tell you that. <laughs> Spoken like a true Catholic priest. My name is Jeff, and uh, according to my wife, I'm a, an alcoholic. I bet you. I, basically, <laughs> what I'm asking you is, for a load of money, I need 100,000 euros. <laughs> Shut the fuck. Don't we all? Shut the fuck. Shut the fuck. <laughs> this is tremendous. This is proper, like, this is proper, like, rural Ireland. Comedy. It's like Tommy Tiernan wrote this entire show. You are loving me, Salmon. Uh, I suppose I do, yeah. And you like when we listen to Iron Maiden and we play the music? Yeah. And you are loving the sex we are having? Oh, yeah, loving the sex. <laughs> so you're here for a long have you ever been on a date like that with a girl where it's just like she's just trying her hardest to like do all like the cues like the, you know the hair and eye contact so it's like fuck off man we know what you want this one's fucked this one just doesn't want to be milked hard men are going to get some this one just doesn't want to be milked it's just so Irish it's amazing that's not PJ Gallagher at all is it it's just not him like <laughs> oh no man that's the ante fuck your cars come on let's go <laughs> it's coming over now come on Get everyone over here. Get the carrots out here. Yeah. How am I going to lift all the carrots out here? They've set roots now. <laughs> How long have you been at your current address? Three, four days. <laughs> Three days. I'm living on a mate's couch at the moment. Like before that, I was out of the cottage since I was 15. Yeah. Um, contact um, details. I'm sure I don't be giving out my number to every Tom, Dick, and Harry. No, I'm, I'm thinking about going to New York as well, to the Windy City. So it's for a holiday. Well. Working holiday, like, you know? <laughs> He's gone in for a loan. He's gone in for a loan for a holiday. <laughs> There's a bit of cash handed over. Well, sure, we'll see. What sort of bargain are you talking about? Uh, you might even move it down to 1200 Hey, Hard what are you doing? Hey, what are you accusing him of? No, are you no, checking no, no, for wait, us? Wait, I'm just checking up your skirt for the mole. What? <laughs> 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 hey, 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 go easy, man. He thinks that's the girl of his dreams, man. Fix! <laughs> 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 He's doing the ice bucket challenge. Big shout out to MC Salmon and his new beer. She's stacked. That was a disastrous best man speech. <laughs> Too high. Too high. <laughs> Right, well that was the Hardy books. I've never seen the show. I'm gonna do a f I'm actually gonna watch the full thing. I don't know where I'm gonna find it. Might be in the RT player or something. Pretty decent show. I'm gonna start giving a rating at the end of uh, all these videos, by the way. I I'm gonna give that like a solid nine out of ten. I wanna like go through all the Irish TV shows that are there. Uh please give me suggestions down below as well in the comments of like any sort of Irish TV show you want me to check out. Uh, eventually I'm gonna do like a tier list of all of them and see like where they rank, blah blah blah. That was genuinely really, really funny. Like I don't think I've laughed that hard at the show in a long time. Like the in-betweeners mixed with The Office, which I thought was great when it's like an Irish version. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna probably watch that. Thanks for everyone that suggested this, by the way. Today's whiteboard is Jack Manning. If you wanna go to the whiteboard for the next video, comment down below. Hardy Bucks. I'll talk to you in the next one. Cheers for watching. Song of all.